to Brownwood now. You'll remember we told you yesterday more than 200 Kohler Company employees will be laid off. KRBC's Katherine Garcia went to Brownwood today to talk to locals about those layoffs. The news of a major layoff by Kohler quickly spread around the town of Brownwood. It's sad. There's going to be a lot of families that are going to hurt from it. Longtime resident and barber Donna Johnson says she recently spoke to an employee of the plant who has worked for Kohler for 20 years. That's a long time. He didn't say he'd be laid off, but I'm thinking if they lay off somebody like that, it seems like... You're, you know, if you have an employee for 20 years, I want to keep them. Which is exactly why the Brownwood Municipal Development District sprang into action, says Executive Director Ray Tipton. My first actual reaction was, okay, we got to take care of these people. Tipton contacting Robert Pools, a business consultant for the Workforce Solutions of West Texas. Hopefully we can transition as many of these individuals who get laid off as possible into a, a job, a new, a new career or the next career. With only 60 days until Kohler employees employees are laid off, Workforce Solutions utilizing its rapid response program, which will provide job fairs, unemployment education, and workshops. We want to identify those folks, identify the opportunities for them, help them get jobs, and get them back to work just as quickly as possible. In Brownwood, Catherine Garcia, KRBC, Abilene's Local News. Thank you, Catherine. Workforce Solutions meeting with the Kohler plant earlier this afternoon to begin its contingency plan. Tipton says it's unclear if the Brownwood plant was anticipating such a drastic cut in its personnel.